Hey guys, what's happening? It's me, yet again, uh, doing some more oversharing. Uh, I wasn't going to do this. Uh, this is a video response to Andy, Tactical Jackalope, as he's affectionately known, uh, to his video um, question about what kind of model maker you are. And uh, like I said, I wasn't going to do a video response, but then Carlos Mendez did one, and since I want to be like Carlos when I grow up, I figured, hey, he's leading by example. I better get to it. So at any rate, Andy's question is, are you a painter? The kind of person that really enjoys the artistic, creative part of the process the most? Are you a builder, the type of person who enjoys the process of assembling and construction the most? Or are you a scratch builder? Um, you know, the kind of person who can basically take a pile of plastic sheet and brass rod and turn it into an award-winning uh, model of a Sherman tank. And uh, my answer is uh, yes. Sort of. <laughs> I'm not definitely at that level with scratch building. Um, I, in fact, I'm so pathetic at it that I feel proud of myself when I add a single piece of lead wire uh, to represent a hydraulic line, but I really do like it. I enjoy it, and I hope to get better at it. As far as the differentiation between painting, being a painter or a builder goes, um, that one's really, you know, that, that one's really tough for me to, uh, to, to pick a preference because I find that when I am in either of those phases of the model building process, that I love it. It's my favorite thing. I, I really enjoy putting things together and I enjoy the process of, of, of building and trying to create the most structurally sound hunk of plastic that I possibly can. And that goes back to probably the fact that I grew up as a farm kid. And uh, I learned how to weld when I was about 12 years old. and I had high school uh, vocational ag shop class and I took every shop class I could, even in college, even when I was in engineering school. Um, I managed to convince them that I needed to add some credit hours of practical experience to my curriculum. And uh, I have found my way into wood shops and machine shops my whole life. And uh, I, just, I just love that. Uh, so always working with my hands and building things has always been one of my happy places in life. But I have this sort of weird left brain, right brain thing going on. And uh, I love art. And I love the creative process. Um, I don't always feel very creative, but I like to try and, and, uh, and, and tell a story with paint or with photography. And uh, hello, air compressor. Thank you for interrupting me. Uh, and, and, you know, that is rapidly becoming one of my favorite parts of the process is especially when it gets into the weathering part of it, because I like to try and bring my models to life by, you know, creating the impression that some tiny little people actually used them and that they have a, you know, that they have a history. So uh, it's sort of an all of the above thing for me, and uh, I don't expect that, that, that that's going to change anytime soon. I just keep enjoying all parts of the process more and more, um, and I'm going to just keep doing what I do, and uh, there you go. That's my very first ever video response to somebody else's YouTube video. I hope I did it right. <laughs> Much love. See you guys.